This video is about uh, using itty midi loader or song loader. First time you start it up, start up something like this and uh, here are the folders on your computer and there's a list of the files, the MIDI files that it will find. Uh, over here are details of what it's going to put onto the palm. So on here you would find wherever you've got your music. On mine it's under a, a folder called Palm MIDI and underneath that there are carols and there's also another folder called Lively. Um, if we go to the carols one first, as you see over here we've got book one started. Um, nothing in it at the moment. You have the opportunity to manage books so you can create new books and uh, you can duplicate details whatever um, there's also code and manual in there. I think they're details to do with itty midi itself. I just ignore those. But basically book one uh, is there at the moment. So let's use that. And if we want to put one song in, we highlight it and click on add. If we click on several and do shift, bit, when we do the bottom one, click on add, it'll add all those. Um, and if you use control, press control and you can add um, individual ones and it already says it's already got one there song 4 so say uh, overwrite it so you got song 1 2 3 4 5 7 haven't got 6 we'll add that one in book and it's all ready to go into book 1 as you see install has been highlighted saying it's ready to do that but you might want to add something from another directory over here. Oh, pause. You might want to add what, something from another folder, say Lively. Then you might want to put Tune 5 in there, so you can add that one. Having got all those, you can now install that. And it will ask you what the name of your user is on your palm. Mine, it's Don Johnson. Say OK. I'll now put the rest of the stuff in a new book. I'm going to create a new one. I don't have to call it book, but um, I could call it, if you like, lively. OK. And uh, I could create any more, but if not, that's done. Up here now you can select book one or lively and those other two that I don't worry about. So if we go into lively, go into the lively directory we're already there we can add those we can add the ones that was already been put somewhere else um, one at a time or we can press shift at the bottom and add them all clicking on install and there you go so now those two sets that have uh, been put into the two books lively and book one the next time you do a hot sync they will be transferred onto the palm. You can delete files from here, um, uh, but you can't actually delete them from the palm itself. You have to do that on the palm. These uh, tunes will go into books which are stored on the palm, and again, you can't edit the books themselves on the palm, but you can create playlists on the palm where you select tunes from one or more books to create a playlist and that can be edited. Unfortunately I can't make a video about that so uh, that's the end of this one.